Welcome back, Heavenlies. This is Heaven's Army playing Sekiro, episode 9. I am so pumped to be home early because I get to do an extra hour of this game. So awesome. So I'm just checking out because I changed the colors and stuff again on my screen and everything seems to be fine, actually. The red is still red. Good. Um, I'm gonna just quickly travel. I will be going through this place. Absolutely will be going through this place. Um, my friends told me of all the extra battles. I pretty much found all the ones that they were talking about. Uh, the monkey thing happens after that, and the, the dude at the temple, the, or whatever I want to call it, the, sh the snake shrine. Uh, the red-eyed ogre, like, all of that stuff kind of happens then, and then, like, more happens after something, and then more happens after this this area here so I could go and like nitpick uh, a couple bosses and then I could go and nitpick a few more bosses or I could just get through the new area Indeed. and then that'll unlock stuff so I kind of got some good um, items I guess I can say because I decided to unlock everything that I could unlock um, all I need now is uh, that's what it's called, lump of gra uh, grave wax, and then I need more um, un un oh <laughs> fluminated mercury. Now I got some already before, but I need more now. But uh, I'm I'm getting close. I'm getting close to getting at least all of this row done. That's what I was working on. I spent all my money shopping, uh, so I don't we don't have to go shopping right now. Um, but what happened when I went up to that world, apparently all of the hey, shops, still have some. That, that means all of them, you can now buy these. Um, and I have 78 of them now. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go, the moment I get a chance to go headless hunting all the way. don't know if I need snap peas anymore, I think I might have something to do, but I will spend this because I don't know. Oh, and I'll buy that too. Why not? There you go. Great. Uh, now you got no Until money to lose. Time. All of the shops, even the crow dude, even the other crow dude, like all of them, they all seem to have that now. Um, so awesome. Um, I can show you where I was fighting because um, I ran around all over the place. If you want to know, Luke, Crime Waves Smith is back. Welcome back, Luke. How are you? I see you're on Facebook. Hopefully all is well. Um, I fought in the antechamber. I fought in a few places actually. Um, I was trying to get some stuff done, and and, and seeing what gave what what gave what gave what. Um, so I got a lot of iron and magnetite and divine confetti drops from the blue. Uh, samurai dudes. I didn't know that. Now, I may not get it this time, but, like, it seems every, like, five runs I got a divine, divine confetti, uh, from this dude up here. I'm about to sneak the first time. What I do is usually break all of this, because it's kind of hard to sneak around. This guy here drops divine confetti. They dropped pellets, and they dropped plenty of pellets. I bust this open. And, and I break all of that. And then I also kill this guy, just for the fun of it. Oh, sneak. Because yeah. that guy gives you like uh, 600 uh, skill points, and he also drops pellets, um, yellow candy, and, and, and stuff too. So like, I just kept doing this over and over. Now that I broke it, you just rest and you don't have to run. If you run, be careful not to keep holding run, but uh... To kill him. Oops, early. Why? Why me? <laughs> too early. I attacked him way too early. Uh, he didn't drop anything that time. But yeah, these people don't really hear you. I, I do have all the sneaky stuff on. He dropped scrap iron and pellets again. But yeah, I mean, I just did that over and over. I already have almost enough to buy more divine confetti. I did that a bunch. I also ran around through Simpo Temple, and I killed the dude out there to give me some 
I doubt he's going to drop it this time. Was it Mercury? Was the other stuff adamantite? I think. Um, I did a little. <laughs> I was just running everywhere, and then killing people seems to give you certain things, and it's awesome. But uh, uh, I I know most likely there are better ways to get things, but like I I just want to do easy things. I'm not here to do a big fight over and over. So that guy. Hopefully, maybe. Scrap magnetite and then more of the yellow sh candy stuff, yeah. Not that. We got plenty of magnetite. I don't know, I ran here, then I ran here. And now they hear me. So now I walk over. And I kill both of them, because they also can drop the magnetite. For some reason, they don't hear me. So I kill them all. <laughs> and then drop... Drop the other stuff, please. Adamantite scrap. There it is. There's adamantite scrap. Nice and easy. No, no, no challenge whatsoever. Um, I was just grinding for this stuff. Where else did I go? I went to the Undershrine Valley and luckily got my my mercury from from that guy, and I also got mercury from poisonous uh poison pool. The guy up at the top. He's not gonna drop it, but um. Because it was, I only got one drop from him. And same thing with the other guys at the under, under. I just hopped over and killed the two gunner people, and then went back. And my first go, I got the, the Falluminated mercury. And then when I tried again and again, I got none. So <laughs> I don't know. It seems to be a very rare drop, but uh, for the mercury. But uh, just kept killing this guy over and over. Didn't even drop anything that time. And I also killed, um, I said under, under Shrine Valley, there you are. Uh, and I just took out the two archers. Now, like I said, I got them, but I only got them once each, and then I never got any more. So I don't know if those are a good spot for them. But, um, what I can do is, like, test out all these weapons now. I, I really have a lot of, a lot of stuff. And I don't know what any of them does because I just bought them. They died. That guy dies. Yeah, antidote powder, black gunpowder, yellow gunpowder. That's what they kept on dropping after they dropped the mercury. Hey Troy, welcome back. How are you? Um, so yeah, like that's what, what I've been doing. I, I've mostly been staying, like I said, at at the antechamber. Um, I've got lots of skills and lots of stuff. Oh, I also were fight was also fighting the hidden forest. Uh, when I watched back my episode and I fought those dudes, I'm good as always. I'm live early, so I'm like extra happy. <laughs> Uh, that means one less hour of work and one less hour and one more hour of fun. So I was pretty happy with that. So I'm, I'm stoked. So these guys here, um, they're very easy at this point. And that's 600 experience. I lost track of it. And that's 600 experience, and you can even kill them quicker if you don't lose track of them. There's like 2,040... 1,240 skill points. Done. Just like that, and you just repeat. You don't get any items or money, but if you're looking for skill points that you want to aim for, go for it. So, I learned something, I think, but it doesn't really matter what it was. <laughs> At this point, I would like to unlock either this skill or this skill that one looks really awesome because it looks like i'm gonna constantly keep attacking but i need nine skill points plus plus whatever it takes to unlock this dash which is all of this i need uh oh three and two and then six and then nine that's a lot of skill points that's a whole lot of skill points. So, like, I don't know how else to, to tackle this stuff. Projected force. After using a prosthetic tool, allows one to draw the power 
of the tool into the sword, place it in a forward direction. Sort of umbrella, finger whistle. I don't know, but I don't even know. That's, that's three. I'm going to unlock the fire soon. Whatever. I'll just learn this stuff. Two. Need a three and a four. That's seven. Close enough, because the, the fire one is down here, and then I only need five. So, I mean, it's easy. Weren't you a higher level than five last time I was here? Oh, you're looking at skill points, my my friend. Skill points are just skill points. Uh, well, they allow, allow me to buy the things in that menu that I was just in, and really nothing else. Oh, I should go headless hunting right now. Uh... Where was that headless at? Uh, no, you're not. There's, you haven't played this game before, right? So how would you know what's what's what and what's where? So no worries. There's one. So uh, I I kind of like got tricked with the water, with the water one. Uh, this fight is as easy as the first one. Um, you just gotta run in with the, your divine stuff. You have played it. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, then I don't know what you were thinking. Yeah, <laughs> Troy, I, I I can't help you there. Then you gotta go in aggressive and don't worry about anything else. Just go in aggressive, um, and constantly keep attacking. Do not lay off of the of the attack. It would be best to have this ready, and it would be best to have my divine confetti ready, because uh, now I have plenty. Now I can try, and if I lose, it's not so bad. Um, this allows me to attack harder, increases vitality and posture damage, so that means I'm hitting the enemies a little harder, or this allows me to re re have reduced vitality damage from physical attacks. I don't know if I'm getting physical attacks, so let's just do this. And let's do... This I have I have five. Look out of the way. What a difference, right? Oh, I got terror. I didn't even see it. I was I wasn't even paying attention to terror. I uh resurrect. Jump away, jump away. Terror's up again. I can't see. See again. Now I ran out of uh, confetti, but I can, like I said, I got plenty of these now, so now I don't feel afraid to use them. And problem solved. <laughs> Uh, what's up, Luke? <laughs> you seem to be saying holy in a lot of other words that I can't even say. So yeah, that's all you gotta do. It's so easy once you finally, like, figure out... I forgot that I did it on my first fight. I went in and I attacked and I broke him and then he just... I won. And then I fought the water guy and I had to be... I had to be defensive. I had to swim around and stand on the defensive stuff, right? And then when I fought this guy, he defeated me, and I'm like, what is going on? Why can't I beat this guy? And then I watched myself beat the first guy and went, oh, all I did was attack. I didn't defend like I was defending. So yeah, it is really that easy, everybody. It really is. Just attack, and then wait for the attack to come. It's very slow. Parry once, go on another attack. Parry again, attack. And if he does get behind you, 
you are better off hopping and running away. Because if he grabs you, you're dead. It doesn't matter how strong you are. And if he doesn't do anything, that gives you time to remove terror. That gives you time to heal up. Because that terror does fill pretty quickly. So yeah, there you go. I got another one of these. I'm going to use another ability to slow down my terror. Hopefully I'll do a full combo, kill the guy back away, and then remove terror and stuff. Because I keep forgetting about that bar. I don't even see the terror bar. <laughs> I'm, that, I'm that focused on a fight I never see it. Headless hunting is going better than I thought. I should just go and kill the other one that I know where he is. Uh, I should just go and kill him. Fallen Headless Spirit of Gatchin? We'll go with Gatchin. Gatchin. Suppresses sound and presence, making the user harder to detect. Consume spirit emblems to repeat. Makes me even harder to detect? I don't need any more of that. Uh, I'm falling to pieces, said the man to himself, drifting deep into the forest. Falling to pieces. Well, wow. Okay, well there you go. I got plenty of divine confettis. Now I have no problem. Uh, oh, I can't make it up there. I must be able to make it. Um, to, to go and challenge them now. Like, I have... Uh, before, I was just like, I really don't want to in case if I die, and... Now it's just like, yeah, let's fight them. Where is my save at? This thing does not know I have Divine Confetti on. <laughs> that poor rooster. Uh, over there is the wrong way. I need to go up there. Ah, okay. Because I'm like, that rooster- Ah! Wait, game! That- this game keeps doing this to me. Uh, all uh- Oh, not Nightbot controls those. I will kill you, never live terror on. I will kill you, never live terror on. <laughs> Is this some kind of, like, word scrabble you're trying to, to get me? With? <laughs> I will kill you, never. It will never kill you. It will never kill you, never. It will kill you, never, live on- live terror on. Uh, there you go, I made the jump that time. The bonus. I'm trying to read your thing over and over, Troy. Uh, it will kill you all the time if- if the terror hits you? Is that what you were trying to say? <laughs> uh, but I'm glad that working. Bautisano is still broken for those who are trying. Okay, so wait a minute. I just took out a uh, headless. Where is the other one? Because I wrote it down. I, I wrote it down. Uh, scroll uh, headless. Sunken Valley. Under Shrine Valley. Oh, it was just there. And then the one in the Ashina Depths Hidden Forest. Done. That one's already killed. Let's actually go there. Uh, under Shrine Valley. Let's that one in the cave. Unless you you want a tongue twister. No thanks. Don't even spend money on those tongue twisters. Tongue twisters are pure evil. I did, <laughs> I didn't know how bad they were until uh, people show up and started using those. <laughs> I I was really hoping they'd go with movie quotes and stuff. Uh, but I, then again, I still need to learn a lot of movie stuff as well. Oh, Malice is here. Speaking of terrible tongue twisters. <laughs> uh, but yeah, welcome back, Malice. How are you? So I just killed the other headless, no problem. I've, I've showed everybody how to do it now. Because I watched myself fight the first one, and, the, and then I kind of slapped myself in the forehead for forgetting how. I already hit uh, the headless in the lake at the Ashna. Yeah, that's the one that messed me up, Luke. That was the second headless I fought, and uh, and uh, that one was the one that made me go on the defensive. Um, and then when I fought this one, this was the third one I found, um, I couldn't beat him. Uh, and I was like, what's going on? I didn't, I didn't want to go up too fast, so... I want to slow down, so like it, it threw me off a lot. To uh... yo, can I like sneak around or put like a jump on this dude? Because that would be awesome if I could. Um, I would love to get like a, a sneak attack in or two, but I don't see anything, so I'm just gonna run right at him. Oh, there's an item back there I didn't even get. <laughs> can I get close enough to lock on? 
No. All right. Let's not say we did. Uh, get back on this. <laughs> uh, so yeah, like uh, yeah, my first time with the headless was horrible because I never knew about the item. See that that's brutal malice, and I thought you had loads of help. But uh, I fought some stuff too, and I'm like, why can't I kill it? And then they're like, yeah, you got to use the divine stuff. And then now that I can buy them, I don't mind. I don't mind using these up now. Oh, did that? Did he hear me? I think I was too close, everybody. He spun right around. Uh oh, no, 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 get away. Don't let him grab you ever. Okay, step away. Remove terror. Heal up. Oh. Get away from that attack. Dead. This that's ridiculously quick. Woo! Okay, now don't forget I am further into the game. I'm very late game. You can do this earlier. It may take you two full candies to defeat them. Um but remember, going on the offensive like really makes them easy. It gets rid of all of that terror around him. And once he gets rid of the terror, now he's gonna attack in normal time. That's what that's why I got hit there because I forgot that he's moving normal speed now, and uh, it just makes the battle ridiculously easy. But you gotta do it that way, or you can try to struggle and <laughs> fight him however are the way you want to fight. But anytime he warps, just hop away. He's always gonna uh, warp behind you, so just hop away, heal, remove terror, whatever you gotta do. And just go back on the offense again. It, it, it's so easy. You can't do this one early because it's swimming. Right. Um, but you can, the moment you get some divine confetti, you, you can do it. It's just, I would save at least two or three divine confettis to take out two. Well, I guess they're really side bosses too. They really are. I guess you could wait until you can start buying some of the stuff. So, Gokan, or Gokan's spirit fall. Fallen head the spirit of Gokan. Reduces posture damage taken for a time. Consume spirit emblems to use repeatedly. Uh, awesome. Uh, headless are... Okay, same thing. Dedicated burial mounds quietly appease the spirits with severed heads, though none call upon them for long. So they like to hang around with... Graves? Oh, I needed some of this, actually. I uh, gotta go do it. Happy hunting. Well, you take care, Luke. Thanks for freaking out when I took out a headless really quickly. <laughs> I appreciate you freaking out for me. I need more of this, uh, and I need more of the mercury stuff. But yeah, there you go. The two headless that was giving me problems, they're now dead. Now I can kind of move on. I didn't mean to. I meant to do this after I was done exploring the other place, but you know what? Cool. Um, I got stuff written down, like make sure I give the, the frozen tears to, to my dude. Yeah, to my lord, Kuro. I don't need to read that, but I just wanted to make sure I got everything written down. I killed both of the headless that I found now, so I don't know of any more. But I, if there's as many headless as there are candies, then there is probably one more. I can hop up here. Could I have, like, sneaked up on him and, like, y y chaw him? I mean, he got no head, so I don't know if I can actually do that but i actually pulled off a win yeah i mean it, it just the confidence and knowing what to do uh having that confidence really does help i changed my axe to a flaming spear um right how about we go and test that out because i don't know what these moves do and it's and it's embarrassing so i'm gonna go to a world where i know the enemies are weak i don't think they've reset in the past but uh I'm out here. Uh, I am out of here, but I may be back. I need something. Okay, so Troy and Luke gotta goes. So yeah. Um, but Malice, 
Uh, did you see last episode? I went on a boss killing spree, and I mean three or less tries, I think I got all the bosses. I took out Owl in two tries, I took out the, the Corrupted Monk on one try, I, I was like absolutely floored on, on what happened, because like I said, I don't expect me to do well, and then when I do well, I am like freaking out, because I'm like, is that awesome or is that not awesome? Did everybody else go through this like this? But yeah, um, it was craziness. I gotta travel too. I'm thinking the easiest spot to fight here. In fact, if I went to the thicket slope and went go backwards, I can try out these weapons on them. Yeah. Uh, let's give it a whirl, cause I I killed <laughs> I killed my training dummy. So now I can't try these weapons out, <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. We got other training dummies. It's called these humans. So this kunai is awesome. I, I like it because it, it fires and hits and then the, the butterflies go behind and it hits again. But um, we kind of know what the shurikens do. Um, if I hold it, it'll do something else and hold for a swarming dance. You know what? I've never done that. I'm not going to throw center around. Uh, and I'm going to hold square and press square while spurning strike to cause more whirls again. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, didn't mean to remove that one. I meant this one. Put on flaming whirly spinny axe. Okay, so the shuriken that if I hold it... Ha ha ha! Awesome! Are you kidding me? Oh! Wait, they, they didn't even hear me? They, they those, those two guys didn't even hear me. They can just hit square and keep spinning around all day long? Oh, I like that. Uh, I didn't know I could kill somebody instantly like that. Alright, cool. Let's try the, the spiral spear, because that's the most upgraded weapon. And with it, I could hit square and then pull an enemy close. We can tear poorly for the armor or hold square for a rush. Let's go and do that. Oh wait, I got fire! Or a leaping flame. I could equip different spears on at the same time. This doesn't work as I thought it would. Uh, apparently, is this the best one? Shelter as an enemy attacks. That for shelter. Attacks. I'll go with this one. Uh, I'll try to use... I don't know why I'm sneaking. I don't want to get caught, I guess. Now for a flaming jump now. Okay. <laughs> that ended nice and quickly. Um, okay, I got two more things. I got firecrackers. I got the awesome flame vent. I I did use holding that. Oh, but I didn't can I didn't hold and then hit square to completely flame vent. Let's try flame vent on on them. And then I got this 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 golden vortex thing. Uh let's try golden vortex. That did nothing. Yeah. Oh, I'm out of I'm out of watch my collins. Oh no, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm not gonna make it. Uh, not really. I just want to go and re revive up. This is a completely off track of what I was going to do. But so, what does the vortex thing do? What does this What does this actually do? It's supposed to do something. Uh. Release it to force enemies caught in a vortex to face the other way. It can be performed twice in a row. Enemies that have been turned around drop items and money to consider donations. Uh, donation world. Assign, assign, aside from strong enemies, they will lose sight of you and go vulnerable. Uh, use the fan to warp yourself into a maelstorm. 
uh, while gathering the maelstrom of divine abduction. Oh, that sounds way better than what I was going to use this for. That was cool. Uh... This guy not gonna... Okay, that did nothing. So what was... What? 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 Okay. Okay, that didn't work. I don't know why whenever I do this. I, I don't I don't get this fan thingy, but <laughs> What? When you uh they have to be in the vortex when you cast it. Keep running out of abilities. Yeah, I keep these eat up a lot of spirit tokens. Uh that fan is kind of weird. I can just block anything I want. Hold out. Protect against light attacks, apparently. Uh, it also prevents the buildup of burns, but this one? Prevents damage from apparition attack types. Enemy attacks can be deflected by spinning the umbrella. And this one? It won't protect you from low attacks such as sweep attack. This one will? Hold out while moving. I don't know. This one seems to be as good as these. This one protects against that, those and that protects against fire. whoop de doo right? I guess? Either way, I, I am really comfortable with what I have. Uh, my Sabimaru that's supposed to be piercing and poisoning people really doesn't pierce, but it says it was supposed to and i do like firing off my uh kunai now it's uh, that that or the shuriken i really do like both of those uh, they have to be in the vortex with you when you cast it that seems rather tricky i wanted to like whatever it said whisk them away or whatever but all right cool um let's just travel to where i'm supposed to go we're here last episode So it's a, it's impressive that the beginning of the game, episode like one, two, and possibly even three, the bosses were all giving me a brutally hard time until I finally figured out to stop dodging. That's when I noticed I started getting better. When I stopped trying to dodge every attack, and I started fighting the way the game told me to, to jump sweep attacks, to Nikiri counter thrust attacks. To only thing to dodge is really the grabs if you can do that or if you're lucky to kick them in the head uh, with a grab that's very hard to do though um, and make sure you counter everything or parry or whatever you want to call this uh, yeah and that's really all it takes to like beat this game uh, I have no grab of my own uh, okay I went over there and then I got seen by a bunch of enemies uh, so how about we go in the house this time, and we'll work our way... I would rather be on top of the roof again, but because I don't want to get ambushed from the top and the bottom. He stopped. Okay. I don't know what you were about to do, but I'm glad you died in like one hit. Uh, lump of grave wax. These people drop lump lumps of grave wax. Okay, perfect. Uh, by the time I go through this area, I might have what I need. Uh, you're more my left. One on my right, but I don't see the one on my right.
Oh, he's behind there. There's a proper sneak attack. Okay, what's out here? A lot of water. Something on top of the roof? I'm not too sure if that's an enemy or not, but alright. Uh, okay, it looked like I was able to climb up, but that was just a hole through the roof there like that. Oh, okay. Uh, that must have been the guy that saw me when I walked over there. Okay, we're getting somewhere, everybody. Already crossed through a bunch of buildings, apparently. The last time I got attacked when I hopped up on a roof, but everything seems to be pretty safe here now. I could hug that wall. I could go swimming, apparently. Or I could go over here, and I'd prefer to go over here before I go over there? Yeah, that sounds like a right thing to do. But how do I get up on this roof now? I would prefer to be up above. Alright, like, getting to this point in the game, like, now I don't find the game so bad anymore. Like, I'm, I'm strong, and uh, I can take a few hits, and I can heal a bunch, and it's just like, things are good in the world. It just It's just like all the other games, after a while I can finally do some damage with my intelligence, or, or be, is it that Twitch that just froze, or... Okay, it's just Twitch that froze. Okay, thanks, Twitch. The screen just went loading, and I'm like, uh-oh. But no, everything's fine on my end. It was just Twitch. So, I can hop over there. I know I'm going to get attacked by that monkey girl thing. But this time, I'm going to go up and away. That's right. You're not expecting me up here, aren't you? Wait, that's another person, isn't it? I'm gonna go slow. Did I not get attacked by her, or is that... Just, I thought it was one over to my left. How dare you get up. So that one's over there dancing. I, I saw this one before. Is he facing me or not facing me? If he's not facing me, I'll just hop down and, and take him out. But there's another there's another enemy somewhere. <laughs> Are you kidding me? They're both there. Alright, let's take him out. I'm so glad he did not see me. But yeah, like just I had a hard time at the beginning of the game and now it's just like the game finally mellowed out and I could finally win. It's crazy how well I can sneak. <laughs> okay, now I recall being jump attacked from down below. I tried to... Uh-oh. Which sure is, like, buffering a lot tonight. I didn't mean to fall down. Uh... Oh, brilliant. Okay. Okay, I think I'm where I want to be. Where was that? Oh, you're there. Can I go around the corner? No, you're not even facing me. Perfect. So, I got lucky. <laughs> That's all of them. Alright, now I can hop down here. Deal with those two. I like how you stopped, but... Ah, okay, I thought I could hit you out of the air, but no. Again, I thought I could hit you out of the air. Yeah, so they don't even stop. I guess they're just so heavily armored that they don't even stop when I attack them. With this katana, when they jump in the air, so that's fine.
Okay, I don't like that attack because it just seems to just teleport anywheres behind me and almost and be able to hit me, I mean, if I don't move. Okay, I just want to hop up um, down here, also blocked off. Over here, also blocked off. Okay, now we're getting somewheres. Hop over on the other side of this. Okay, also blocked off. I hope this person doesn't see me. Okay, it seems to be... Okay, are you looking... Okay, that person's facing me. He's kind of looking, well, that way right now. I went this way? I'm mean, looking away. Wow. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, hooray. Give me that items and give me this. Lump of grave wax. I am getting a bunch of lumps of grave wax, grave wax which is what I need. So awesome. Um, now I'm at this building where I jumped down before. I'm at this wall, which seems to be the dead end. Except, there's an item up here. Okay. Oh, there's a bunch of... This is continuing on. I thought I was going towards the hands up there, but I guess I was wrong, maybe. And there is nothing over here. Okay. I'll get back up. See another dancing... Oh, that's a, that's a wolf, is it? Oh, something sees me. Oh, almost saw me. This call. Awesome. That works, like, very well. Something over there sees me, but I don't trust it, so... Wait, can I absorb the item from here? Oh, they were guarding something. Like Are you kidding me? That worked too well! That worked a little too well. Are you kidding me? I was able to sneak attack, they look over there, and I'm like, I'll just go up and around and over then. Uh, sometimes when plans work, it works very well. So even if I miss, the butterflies home seek in after my enemies. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> I... I'm okay with that. There's two more over there. And what else is on these roofs? I want to stay on the roofs, kill everything from up above, and I'll deal with things later, like... Like, I don't even know what these doggies do, so... Lightning, really? No, 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 come on. I want him to do that really, really badly. That's really hard to dodge. Okay, I couldn't really uh, lightning that because it, it fired straight at me, so when I jumped, it kind of. Missed me every time. It's nothing like the other lightning attacks. Alright, cool. I was practicing. I mean, I kind of know how to do it. I just need to do it in the middle of a probably a boss fight. And that's what's really hard about things. Is trying to do that <laughs> when you're in duress. Yeah, when you're totally having heart palps and stuff. Make the jump. There we go. Quietly. Quietly. Apparently an enemy hears me sneaking. Oh. Ah. 
Are you kidding me? <laughs> I I mean, I, I don't know. Am I doing this game wrong? Am I doing this game too right? Like, I just, like, I'm killing everything. I don't have to battle. I don't have to do anything. I just kill things. Nothing else needs to be done but kill them. Uh, so pretty, this place. So, let's just try to stay in here. I'll get that building needs to get done, and the rest of this building needs to get done. Okay, so let's do it. Let's one one area at a time. I'll start sneaking again. I thought there was three dogs in here. So it wouldn't surprise me if the other dog... There you are. Took off for some. I thought I saw one. Adamantite scrap. No, I need, no, I need fluminated mercury. I was like, oh, but no, fluminated mercury is what I want. Nothing else but that. Okay, this building seems empty. Okay, that means I cleared out this whole area too. Now there's a gate, or I could swim. That's fun. Uh, and over here is just all... Oh, look, I could go up in there. That'd be cool. So, Melis, you said that this game is pretty much straightforward from here, but uh, I hope I'm doing it all right. I, I don't know what ending I'm going for, other than the one that I hope is the good one. Time to save. Oh, awesome. Uh, okay, I didn't want to rest because I don't... I want to check around here first. This is like a boss here. Is this a door? This is the normal dudes playing the instruments again. I can't seem to warp up there. The reason why I don't want to go yet, because most likely a save is the right way to go, and I don't want to go the right way. Uh, this building. Ah! Well, that hurt. That can hit me and kill me. What is happening? What hit me <laughs> with lightning from across the world? Oh, my goodness. Okay, I feel like going in the water is a bad idea. It's not doing any damage. Ah, uh, okay. What saw me? I just got, like, owned by lightning in water, of course. Maybe I'm not supposed to swim across. Or maybe when I go in the water, I won't get blasted now. I was about to get hit by lightning again, wasn't I? Nope, that can, that can still hit me. I can still get hit by lightning! Lightning attack over there. The dude up on that tree. Okay. I found the one that's casting lightning from the sky. And killing me when I hit the water. Wow. Uh, dive, please. Uh. Okay, I'm not. I'm not super dashing. I don't know if I could grab that. No, I just spin around. Am I gonna die here because I'm in the water and... 
or lightning pants can hit me from anywhere. Okay, he stopped. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so we're not swimming because just that on that tree branch somebody can blast me out of the water and uh it killed uh killed me like right away uh no water till you kill a mini guy uh electrifying it indeed indeed i don't know why you're telling me this even if you told me before <laughs> again with observational clues <laughs> or uh, tips i guess oh okay there's one there Kill, but okay. If I create crouch, she won't be able to hear me. Old lady, I'm not gonna kill you. Excuse me, young man. Young man, please be careful. The I'll try. nobles have a craving for the vitality of youth. They can't help themselves. They want nothing but to sap away more and more of it. I see. And you? The courtyard ahead in particular. It is accursed. It's crawling with palace nobles. If crawling. you must forge ahead, you'd best go around it. So, since she's just warning me. Why are you telling me this? I yeah. have a favor to ask you, young man. What is it? It's about my father. My father is now a noble. And the moment he became one, he found himself entranced by a carp, the great carp. For a long, long time since, he's done nothing but feed that cursed carp. Young man, please release my father from the carp's bewitching powers. I know my father wouldn't wish for an eternity like that. Well, a carp, huh? The courtyard is an accursed place, and it please release just my father. Okay, I can try my best. So there's over there. Up into my right. Bite down. I already have a tooth that allows me to use it forever, so I have to use bite down. It's all right. I'll just kill this guy. Okay, I thought I was being attacked, but I guess I was wrong. It looked like I was really getting attacked, not by like a normal enemy. I don't know. Like a little bit more intense of an attack. Uh, is that a big armor, dude? No, okay. Just look bigger than usual, okay. Okay. Well. It's the uh, long, long dead end hug wall. Okay, my save is here. You never know. I'm going to start hugging walls now because now we know about all those in crazy. <laughs> what am I looking at? Oh, it's one is it like an ox bull thingy again? Okay, well we gotta take on that thing eventually. Can't wait for that. It's not gonna bust through the wall and give me a heart attack, is it? That I don't need. That I truly don't need. Can I get up above and try to deal with that thing?
That's a lot of them, but not really. There's an enemy up there as well. I should have dropped down and killed them. Just avoiding them because I felt like I didn't have to fight them. Okay, Akko Sugar. I can't grab on ledges that have this, this marking on it. I just can only grab on normal smooth edges, I guess. Feebled. Whoa, that was cool. I didn't know that could happen. Wait. When you're enfeebled, you don't even get a revive. Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't know I could get hit by that when I was doing my kill move, but apparently that just took out all my revives. Wow. Okay. You're just stopping me from winning. Oh, I lost a bunch of money there. <laughs> Ouch. Uh, not that I really need it anymore. I mean, I don't know what else to do with money at this point. Uh, I would love to get up the top, but I don't think I can. Or at least get up above and deal with that crazy ox right now. Ooh. I mean, they're just normal guys, right? Just run and kill. Kill and run. I am not a fan of enfeeblement. Oh boy, that's a lot of enemies. <laughs> that's a lot of enemies. You kidding me? So you can't just like run through the world? Oh boy, they're after me. And then some. Oh, that was a thrust. No problem, I can kill you if you do a thrust. Okay, well, this has got a whole lot more harder now, um, especially when they're all in the middle of that courtyard and they're all facing directions. I was able to sneak by and get to the left before, but... <laughs> Look over and he's looking at me and... Yeah, alright, so I snuck by last time. If you swing and hit them while they jump in the air, you can knock them out of the air. Or I could just uh, parry them once, then they go for a thrust attack and I Makiri counter kill them. It's way easier. Because <laughs> all that jumping is going to get me killed. I could really see myself getting killed with the jumping and doing this kind of thing. That only works on sweeps. So yeah, I'm not, I'll, I'll, I best not go too crazy on those. Right here, gotta die. Yeah, I'm not liking these enemies. Not liking them one bit. Uh... I'm so close to this box thing, but I just can't get up to him.
Where is he at? I hear him. Or he dies next. <laughs> They're all just like, huh? Yeah, I'm I'm not moving until they oh boy, until they move, so Apparently one saw me. <laughs> this is uh, interesting to, to go about this. Tight scrap. I don't need that. I don't need any balloon stuff. Really, just need some mercury and other things. All will be good. There's one facing that way. One also facing him. Uh, and... Okay, I hear him. We are not going to get ourselves killed here. There's no point to get this far and then die. After all my hard work. Can I hop out of this? No. But, uh, this is leading me back to where I was. Interesting. I, I still don't see how I get up above on the roof yet, so... We'll hold off. Full ox thingies over there. Ah, more divine confetti. Got two there. Oh, awesome. That's the two I used up for one of the... For one of those headless. Okay. Boy, what's that over there? Uh, a dude who can kill me, and it looks like a bigger, tougher enemy. Ooh, that almost got me. Okay. A lot of sweeps, but I couldn't seem to get the kick on, on the head because they keep moving. Oh, rough. Whew, okay, that's uh, one. There's one more over there and one more over there. He's looking which way now? The enemy heard me in there as well. A red one. Another enemy. Are you... Ugh. Are you kidding me? Okay. Looks like a wall. Okay. Okay, gotta get away. I knew I knew there was something else that saw me over there. It was dangerous, but we lived. Okay, now. <laughs> that was a lightning attack that I was actually ready for. Oh boy, that was crazy. I just jumped up and just blocked and I was like, oh, I hope I got it because I don't know. And I'm just going to jump when I see lightning. Oh, can I go swimming there now? That looks very obvious that I can go swimming there, but... Okay. Oh boy. Uh, I was save. 
I'll touch this. I'm not going here yet. But I, I touched this. Alright, I can kill that lightning guy because it's this way. I made it over here. I didn't want to head over here, I don't think. Over there, I think, is the ox. Over that way is the lightning guy. And I almost have this all cleared out. And I want to clear this out before moving on. Ugh. I can probably pull that guy out of the room by attacking him. Uh, and then get into the room and kill that guy. And then deal with these two over here. So... I almost killed him. Okay, cool. Oh, he's coming out. Oh, I don't want that. <laughs> he came out of the house even better for me. Hmm. Gonna take your time getting over here? I think I could run and kill him, right? Here's hoping. Yeah, okay. They don't seem to be tough, but they can stop you from reviving and insta-kill you. Yeah, that's like those... The things that I really dislike in Final Fantasy. The, like the, the level death moves, or... Level whatever turn you to instant stone moves, or something that'll just instantly kill your entire party if you're like the wrong level and you fight something. Okay, more divine grass. Now, from here. Okay, I think I cleared up the entire area. Awesome. Okay. That was uh, a bit intense. I think I'm going to go for a swim before I move on any results. I don't think I could get on any of the roofs right now. Uh, I could go in some buildings and look up, but I really don't think I could get on the roofs um, at this point. Well, leave it be. That roof looks too high, doesn't it? And I'm jumping underneath means I just can't. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and that roof over here looks kind of low as well. Back at the old lady. Okay, perfect. That is what I wanted to see. Uh, got the items by the tree. Cool. I got... That's too high up now. Fuck here. Alright, cool, everybody. We managed to clear everything out. Now I can go at least back to that save. And save, because now there's nothing else that I need to aim for. Let's try that again, but this time I'll go up above. This roof here is completely locked off. If so. There's somebody breathing, but there's nobody in here. Over here, <laughs> but there's no way somebody's breathing, so... Uh, this way leads me behind... side that, okay? It's the hallway. Yeah, and there's nothing else. Oh, there's probably somebody up on the roof breathing. That's probably exactly... Oh, no, not this one. That's fine. Uh, on the roof. Okay. Can't jump there. Yeah. Cool! I'm just happy I can clear out these areas without dying too much. Uh, and then I guess proceed on. This is my water. Oh, just a little down and a little up. Treasure carp scale. Nice. Treasure carp scale. Double nice. Is it going to be a triple nice? <laughs> What's going on? I love it. What am I getting now? I'm loving getting all these treasures too. Water of the palace. A cup filled with divine waters. Drink popular with nobles of the palace. When a wedding procession arrives at the Fountainhead Palace, 
This is the drink they are greeted with. The nectar of the palace nobles. Go ahead. Drink to your heart's content. I, I, I'm assuming this is like another sake kind of thing. That's right. None of those treasures will live. And I could give this to and get background... Background information on the characters that I give the sake to. Uh, cool. I'm glad I noticed that. That, that was obvious. Though, so, the way they had a hole in water there. Neat. Alright, everything has been cleared out. I'm happy with that. That is how you do things in this world. I hear a here. Just checking, because I'm like, wait a minute, there should be nobody playing music here, but there isn't. Yeah, okay. That's interesting, right? There's nobody around, but there's music playing right there. Cool. Alright, moving on. Just wanted to confirm that. Let's do this. Another area clear. That means we can just proceed on and never come back here again. <laughs> That's plan number one or two. Slide in, because... Oh, can I get over that, maybe? I don't know if I was supposed to make it up on the roof from here, but you know what? I'm doing it. <laughs> Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes to get over to that spot. Now, I think from this save, I could have walked over. One, two, three, four. Another five pagoda tower. Nice. It's two fives I've, I've met, and, met and one and one three. Check the roofs. I could walk. Oh, there's an item behind that. I don't care. Not yet. There's a bull over here, isn't there? <laughs> oh, there's an enemy up there. A bunch of enemies up here. Oh, I kind of don't have an advantage point. I snuck by him. Wow. I'm impressed that I could just walk by right in front of somebody like that. I got to get the one way over there. Oh, that one's facing there and that one's facing there. Okay, there's no way to really do this other than getting seen by one of them, so... Oh, you're facing that way! Oh, even better! Okay, I it really looked like that person was facing to the left there. Yeah, <laughs> but that's the arrow quiver thing. All right. Oh, the sloshing is making me a little nervous, but I'm killing these guys because this would be terrible to fight an ox with. Having them rain down arrows on you, yeah, that would be unpleasant to the maximum. Clear at the area, fight the boss. I don't think that bull was supposed to see or hear me. The bull like coming way over here.
I am very surprised that this bull is coming way... Oh, I finally lost it. Alright, here we go. We're gonna kill this bull in one quick go now. Maybe. Come back. Are you kidding me? Okay, kind of rolled right in front of him. Oopsies. Ooh, careful me. This would be a silly way to die. Especially with all my health. <laughs> In the bit feisty this ball. Rest easy, my bull. Ooh, okay, yeah, that was as, as easy af after you fight them the, for the first time. The first time, I died a lot on that bull. <laughs> the second time, yeah, you kind of already figured them out. The Latin skill, latent skill, that increases the maximum... Ah, of F spirit emblems. Perfect. Awesome. There you go. Another boss down, another prayer bead earned. I like it. To keep this trend up, I'll be max level, max bead in no time. I'm probably missing. Malice said he missed like two beads. I'm probably gonna be missing those two beads too. I felt like I explored very, very hard and stuff to try to like find anything that looked missable, like this weird tree thing that I could hook onto. Oh, it's probably to avoid the bull charge, maybe? Why would you need to avoid the bull charge? I don't know. I don't, I just, that was my only guess for why that was there, unless you hook on the tree and hop on the roof from there. But yeah, alright, cool. I'm not gonna get attacked by that lightning dude from way over here, am I? There's no way he can see me. But, you know what, just in case, that's three more... I bought a bunch of divine confetti because I felt like I needed it, and now I'm like... I even could have used the divine confetti on that, on that bowl and really come out with a win on that very easily <laughs> but I decided to hold off on that all right we're gonna go swim in here there's no way this guy should be able to see me oh no <laughs> he sees me please 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 <laughs> I tried everybody you can hit me from way over there dodge dodge 
Okay, okay. That is ridiculous. <laughs> Guy is deadly to me. I mean, it is lightning and water. That's what's supposed to happen, but lightning. Oops. Scrap magnetite. You know, once you kill him, he stays dead? Uh, yeah, I could assume that. I I mean, or I just could kill him and then just, like, have have fun exploring later, but... You know, it's more exciting when you have a chance to possibly die. Okay, I'm going up. I'm up. I'm up to the top now. I can still hit me. Ridiculous. I can't rev I can- I can warp back now. Why would I go- I- I- you know what? Whatever. <laughs> it's only three- only a- uh, I'm almost gonna lose 2,000 for this. Where is it at? Where is it at? Okay. You can play the lightning dodging game. Ah! <laughs> that jump scared me! Okay, well... That went through the bridge, everybody. Yeah, thanks game for the jump scare, because I'm like, I'm totally safe here. There's no way this guy can get me. Oh, okay, well, that happened. Alright, let's stay out of the water for a little bit. Oh! <laughs> I just swam down there. There was nothing down there. Ah, oh, double jump scare. Come on, game. What are you, a scary game all of a sudden? Remember that uh, farm spot I told you about? Uh, you said you were able to kill somebody. The two easy kills and a small fight. Uh, am I nearing the spot? It's behind you. Oh, so you go from that, that at that, at that idol, and then go back and kill two or three people? Oh, I like it. Okay, I'm up above. A tree is way over there. I see a bunch of enemies up there. Or in the middle. No one's playing football. Awesome. Uh, the, the real football, too. Not that. Uh, not that. <laughs> no, I'm teasing. It doesn't matter if you call it football or soccer. Uh... Just where I'm from, football is football and, and soccer is the other game. Yeah, so... Uh, <laughs> either way, I can sneak up here. Okay, I can sneak up there. Or over there. There is so many people. Okay, I would rather, yes, stay up high and keep going up and around on this thing, for now. Something saw me. I don't know what. Ah, yeah! Alright, take that. Now I can almost go exploring. Uh, oh, there's two of them up here as well. They psyched me out. <laughs> That's twice they psyched me out. Yeah. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Wait, wasn't there one enemy just right there? Uh oh. Did I lose one of them somehow, some way? Oh, there. And there. This is a very... it's getting taller and taller. And I'm like, okay, I was just gonna quickly explore it, but no, not at all. There's so many of them. Okay, even higher. Even higher. Oh, sweet. Hi, Adam. 
Oh, look at that. I missed some items back there. But it's fine. I can go back and get them. But getting to the highest point, items over there, items back here, and then I got a bunch of enemies that I kind of want to get rid of. Uh, or I can just, I think, safely traverse this now. I just don't want to jump through the water. <laughs> yeah, it's at that point when you realize you don't want to jump down there. Okay, this should be safe. Then... Hey, okay. Uh, this leads me here. I can hop back here again. But I'm not hopping over there. Oh. You mean to say I probably gotta jump up from the, the roof and try to make that jump over? It seems a little far-fetched right now. Behind me is what? Nothing and nobody? I just gotta take out these two now? Fortunately, they'll hear me. Perfect. Uh, saw. The one dancing down there. I think there was two walking. And then there's two more over there. My goodness, I can't keep track of all these enemies. Uh, I thought also when I attacked something, two things heard me underneath of this bridge. But I'm not seeing anything right now. This big open area with two of the spear people that can shoot lightning and stuff. Yeah, that's fun. Oh yeah, that's super fun. Uh, thought there was more people. How about we go up to the top again? Try to see if I can make this jump over there. This is just too far. To, yeah, there's no way I can make that jump. So... Unless... I'm not seeing any... Like, there's like a little ledge here. Or it looks like a ledge. It's probably a straight fall down. Adventure, nothing gained. Yeah, yeah. Nowhere near close. The ledges that I tried to jump on also didn't work. Can't grab on that. Get right back up here. Yeah, I am. There's, there's no way I can make this jump. Nice. Okay. I thought I was going to walk on the tree a little bit. Okay. That's not a real, like, tree branch thing. Yeah. We're not making that jump. And I do not see any sense to fall down try to go left because all I see is wall so eventually unless Malice knows the secret to this place so glad that guy did not see me uh he can tell me how to get over there okay up up on that tree Hop up on that tree. What do you... Ah, oh, there they are. That one did not hear me. There's two over there, actually, that I didn't see. Those were the ones that were pacing that heard me from underneath. Okay, I think those are two spear people. I think we almost got this cleared. I gotta get back up on that tree. And then do a quick kill on one of them, and then Uncle Bob. 
Uh, you know what? You get to live because you're being all fancy and stuff. This guy watching you? Uh oh, somebody else sees me. Got two of them after me. That's unfortunate. I did not see that one way over there. Huh. What hit me? Something hit me like a... Was it the ball? Maybe. Maybe the one way over there got me. I am not too sure if they can hit me that far and take with that much health. I didn't see if I lost any health though. Was not paying attention to my health bar. Uh, okay, we gotta get up and over then. We are not dropping down to fight that two spear people. Boarding those two. Oh no, they're right there. I have to go this way. I can drop down and like hopefully kill... Oh, there's three there! Oh, that's gonna make it really, really difficult. Uh, well now he's that far over, I might be able to run up and start fighting the, the ball one. And then... Sword guy. Okay. Now that I got this area cleared out, that guy on the tree is still way over there, huh? Just take with these two spear people. <laughs> I sigh when I say it because it might not go as well as my dream. <laughs> I might get killed here. Oh, I didn't absorb all of the items. Oh, whoopsies. Not like I really needed that item to survive this game, but so, yeah, there's two soul suckers and the one spear guy. <laughs> soul suckers? <laughs> Is that like a new term? Because uh, yeah, I like it. Anyways. Soul suckers. They're like time vampires, but take your soul instead. Okay, there's an item down there, but I can get back. Those are what heard me. Oh, okay, see, so yeah, I just saw the item and jumped down to my death, but dogs were so shocked that somebody would fall for such an easy, oblivious trap. That, uh, <laughs> they were just like, what? And then uh, I killed them both. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Alright, quiet jumps. All I need to do is grab this edge, I think. Game lets me. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. I don't want to get... Yeah, I can't. Okay, so now I gotta really jump up into this place. And then kill. But I, I want to jump in the middle of this. Ah! Missed all of those golden opportunities. at that time. They only seem to do sweeps, so it's no problem once you're only expecting them to do a sweep. Uh, 
problem. I can go along the waterway. I can go along up this upper path. I can take this path here. There seems to be plenty of places to go. Try this way first, and we'll backtrack to see where that leads me. Back to the wolves and down where I got the item. I'm quite certain of it. I'm up that bridge before. Now I'm on this side of it. Oh, there's so much fighting to get through this place. Yeah. Okay, I see another doggy down there. A huge waterfall area. So I can get up here. Was that thump thump in the game or was that in real life? Please tell me, like, it was drums that made that sound. Okay, I don't want to go up here, because this feels like if I get to a boss door, I'm going to be really feeling pretty stupid about this, but... Okay, did something hear me over here, or through the door, or... Is that a hookshot tree? Oh, ho, ho, you are! Getting hit by something and I don't even see them, so... That's fun. Ah, ah, there we go. I was looking at straight ahead, and I'm like, that's weird, I don't see anything. And, uh, oh, I'm up at the, the, the tower! Oh, this is how you get over. I figured it out. I is genius. I is the geniuses of geniusers. Okay, cool. I can warp back to there and get me back out, or I can just drop down and... Save? A save save. Hello? I do not want to rest though. Hello? I see you! One sec! Okay. Uh, do not rest because I do not want all these enemies coming back to life right now. What is over here? Okay, shiny things were those. Uh, there was an item down below. Uh, on the thingy over here. Hello there. Hello there! Yes, one moment. Items first, then you. More divine confetti. Awesome. Alright, now we made it over. I okay, couldn't hug the wall and get in, so that didn't happen. Check the walls again, just in case if there's any scratches or something, then we know. And I was like, okay, let's, let's, let's talk. Do you know about cop scales? I do. Scales of the divine treasure cop. Bring them to me, and I'll reward you handsomely. You the one from the three years in the past? Pot noble, Orimori. A uh, dragon blood droplet. I don't need that. Ah ha ha! I can get two from him, and that is. I need twelve. Well, okay. We're gonna have to crazily go do some carp scale hunting soon. I want that mass to see what it really does. And then I need this to unlock the last tier of my skills. But cool! Alright, we found another... Next time. Well, you stopped charging such uh, monopoly-priced scales and I would have <laughs> I would have bought something. <laughs> but your scales were too much! Alright, uh, craziness. Either way. Am I seeing anything up here? Nope, okay. Pop over here. Uh, oh, 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 I missed and almost fell down all of it. Yeah! Okay, no, you can't make that jump, but I did see a little, uh, whatchamacallit up here. Yeah, I saw that. I just wanted to see if I could grab it. Uh, cool! We made it over! Who would have thunk? Yeah, would, would you have thunk that? I didn't know what was gonna happen. I just found, like, a little jumpy spot over here and it actually led me over to him. So, from this save, I gotta write this down, because it was a bit... Uh, out of the blue. 
Yeah, from that save, from that save, yeah, from that area here, I gotta go all the way through this is to get to one. Is there not a save around? Can I do this? Oh, please let me make it game. Okay, I totally made it with these. Who's after me? Every time I like get over here, the music kicks in, I get a little jump scare, and then I look around and nothing happens. I don't trust this bridge. Oh, why is there no saves around here? I've gone for hours. Is that a blue thing? I saw something blue down there. So many enemies. It's like a lot of I'm fighting I don't think these enemies are easy but I'm just like getting the jump on them and like attacking them and then like it just seems to be working out fine okay another broken bridge this place is falling apart I thought this was like the divine room why is everything broken yeah you're breathing okay that's just me picking up the things up above on the roof. I just, I just like, why are you, uh, why am I hearing this breathing and it's exceptionally loud? So, why? Only when I get into over there, so. Oh, okay. Nothing? Okay, I'll walk around now. So I'm up above, over here, this is where I killed, what's not, that is too many enemies, that is just way too many enemies, is there anything even over there to make me want to get over there, what is that thing over there, oh I think I know what's over there, that's the tree. That's the tree. Okay. Oh, so many enemies. <laughs> that is just so many enemies. Okay, I need to go through the building. And then I want to see what's up on top of this roof. Because I am not trusting whatever is up there. Okay, I don't... It's just an atmosphere, isn't it? There's nothing really up there. It's just atmosphere building, and they just want you to get all jump scared and stuff. And be on your edge, on your guard, on your whatever it is. Oh, okay. No, no, let me heal. Okay, that was way too many enemies. I think that's what I heard breathing, was them. Whew, okay, I'm glad I hopped down though to, to witness that, because if I would have ran and I would have got caught by these people, which I think I'm eventually going to get caught, there's, I, there's no saves around here? I The last save is, I feel like it's a ways back. <laughs> and, and not just like a little bit and I'm pretending, I feel like it's... Is that another shaman dude? Go and kill him if he gave me a neck, uh, a bead thing. No problem killing him. Just this disastrous area right now. Okay. What's what's my what's my plan? What do I have if I run away? I'm dead. Oh no, I can hop up. No, I can't. There's no way I'm hopping up. I have to fall down. I have to run and YOLO down there to this corner. 
This is my only saving corner. Oh, man. Anyway, I'd rather take the fall instead of dying, because I already did die. Uh, this, the Lancer people are the problem? How many of them? Oh, all of them? Oh, nice. <laughs> all of them? No thanks. <laughs> Are you kidding me? This is a little... Oh, items. Uh, this is a little rough. I don't think... If they come down here... No, they're up there. If they come down here, I'm gonna panic, but... Okay, grab all the items so I never have to come back here again. I keep getting a... A boss that keeps spawning on my... I can't see on the map. Every time I walk over here, I see a two health enemy boss bar pop up when I walk over here. I don't know what's going on, but this game really feels like it's glitching right now. Okay, I don't... Okay, another doggy. I'm really close to this guy. I really don't feel like fighting him though. I, I've gone like way too far. Uh, be taking on a boss and then also trying to find a save and then also trying to get back to where I was. Okay, so I'm safe in this water. Don't have to go this way. Uh, I'll go. Okay, all of this looks jumpable, but then it's not. Again, do the boss music. It might be. It might be that thing over there, though. Uh, okay, I made it up it over. Falling down the waterfall means the dogs and stuff. Okay, so we're, <laughs> we're back here again. Yeah, I think it's the, the boss down there. Although they're showing me like a health here. Open? No thanks. <laughs> I'm not gonna open that up. Well, like that just seems like a, a whole bag of worms and like not the fun kind either. So I got one of the spear people taken out. Awesome. Let's try to get another one now. In fact, I'm better off going to the left side because the other spear person is there. And I got two sword people. What? They're not even, they didn't even make it back yet. Lock, please. Oh, another attack is. Yes. kill one of them again with a sneak attack. Then I could just fight fight. Dragon Spring Sake. Perfect. Lawless. Smooth as silk, as somebody said last episode. They're not back, but 
I remember that smooth as silk line, and that's this is running pretty pretty smooth. Haven't been able to touch a save and heal up in a long, long time, and I kind of miss the oh, there's a save. <laughs> this one is still in a bad spot though. What just jingled? Something jingled, and it made me a little nervous, and now it's okay. Okay, I don't want to rest up yet. Now then, Did that guy turn and face me. Oh no, okay. I got a prayer bead from that enemy? Are you joking me? That wasn't a boss? <laughs> that was a normal enemy! Well thanks, you're making it easier on me. Oh, there's another enemy over there on the on the roof. Okay, that was Lightning Man. Indeed it was, but that was very easy. That was no blocking, no parrying, no jumping, no like, curry counters. Nothing. That was straight up easy win. I am kind of shocked that they allowed me to have that. Uh, okay, I touched that save, so now if I go swimming, I'm gonna go and... I think kill... Oh, wait, before I drop down, there's an item here. Uh, go and kill that person. He wasn't there uh, to be hard. He's there to make it make you not able to swim over. Okay. Well, they did a good job on that, I guess. But still, I, I was expecting it to actually be a hard boss fight. I don't know about this person either. I don't know about that carp that was swimming around and destroyed the bridge. But uh, this person, I don't think, is looking at me. Here goes. Me, young... Oh, young man, do you happen to be going to the palace? I was yes. about to attack. <laughs> you, are, you should take the back path. Nowadays, it's underwater, but there is a large cave you can take to get there. Only, I hear the great carp now sleeps there. A cave to get there, but a carp. Sleeps there. Okay, no problem. How about we go swimming first, and then we'll deal with everything. If I go back to the over here, that's right, to the over here. That's the words I'm using right now. I'm not changing it either for you. Uh, person dancing on the bridge. Okay. Okay, I don't think they're going to see me. I hope not. I need the other. I need Mercury. I did not fight the carp. Uh, do not fight the carp. Make sure you swim your tush off past it. There is a reason I cannot explain. Oh, well, thank you. See, I was going to kill the carp. But thank you. This is. You told me it was all straightforward. I would have killed the carp and then I would have ruined something. Oh, you are giving me things that I would not know about. There you go. Now you're doing your thing said you weren't going to help me with because I it's all straightforward from here on out eyes eyes I say don't kill the carp don't kill the carp got it uh I am back at the beginning okay we're gonna <laughs> here okay these are just normal normal fishies wait are they golden ones they were uh I just missed out on all the golden ones they are long gone and then some. Okay. Uh, I wasn't prepared. I thought that was- Ah! He's not going to attack me, is he? <laughs> that scared me. Yeah, the goal- they, they do respond. Once you kill them, they go away. Uh, don't kill- Okay, so I still gotta deal with this goldfish problem right now. I was just gonna enjoy the swim, and I thought I had to swim to a cave. See me, goldfish. 
Good. All right. He, I, he almost saw me, but I think I got away from it. It's facing like the wrong way. Okay, good. Now I want him to go to the right, left. No! 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 He's so fast, and I want him to go left, and he still got me juked. Um... Wait, there's no way he can see through. That was incredible. Oh, wow, he just <laughs> spawned, he spawned right on me. He's just showing you, uh, showing up to scare you here, but he's he's in a cave. He is in a cave? Oh, good. Can I hide in this grass, maybe? I missed. Ooh, got him. Okay, there's a lot of treasure carp scales here. Um, this is awesome. You can hide in the grass. They don't see you when you go into that. Cool. I figured that out. What else can I learn about this game at the end of the game? So far away. They're laughing up there. But yeah, who would have thought you could hide up there? Like in this grass and the fish actually doesn't see you. Oh, you know I'm just gonna yellow for it. Oh, what? I tried to circle dash, but it did not. I tried to circle dash and all I did was R the whole time. I was really hoping for uh can't get in this. Okay, is I I, I don't want to go into a cave by accident. Uh, I just want to like explore. But this is where he busted through and broke the bridge, right? Yeah, there was no carp here. But he busted through here. It gave me a jump scare. Okay, so now... Now we can continue on. Problem. Fish is not my enemy, it's a ginormous carp that would probably be my enemy right now. I still need like a lot of scales and I'm nowhere near there yet. Oh, there's another one, but I'm gonna get away, unfortunately. Ah, I might be able to get him now. Gotcha. Okay, I'm figuring out that you could hide in the grass. This is making my job a thousand times easier. Yeah, <laughs> basically, uh, I'm having no problem getting these carps now in a big open area swimming thing like this. I thought it was going to be a challenge, but they went nice on me. Okay, another completely house that's gone completely underwater. Nothing into it? Nothing into it, okay. There's a lot of red pieces uh, in the water and it makes me think it's it's a carp. <laughs> oh, I need more of that grave wax. Awesome. So this cave must be down here, must be. Because uh, the rest of this looks pretty normal. 
natural. Is this the house that I hide, head into, or is this something else now? No, nope, this is not the house I was hiding into. Okay, we're gonna investigate around. Is this the cave? That's the cave. Everybody, I am out of there. <laughs> that carp is a little too large. You know, I feel like... <laughs> I don't feel comfortable. Oh, oh, oh. How many do I have now? If I can get that mask, I'm just going to go for it. Uh, are you kidding me? That was a lot of pieces. A whole lot of pieces. So we're back here. That was the house that I hit at. There's a... Uh, one way over here. We want to try to get him. Last time that fish got stuck. Okay, no, no, stop. Because he's going to respawn here. See? See how we get smarter, everybody? We just get smarter and smarter. The fish will respawn. Around here somewhere, and we'll just get them. Okay, well, he sp <laughs> spawned it nowhere near where I thought. Anyway, am I hidden now? Good. We're gonna get him this time. <laughs> uh, hunting for uh, for these carps. Poor carps. I mean, what did they ever do to me in this game other than like they have something that I have to hunt down for? Scare him too many times, does he not come back? Did he not like disappear? That would be something if I like broke it, broke it, you know what I mean? Yeah! <laughs> I just had to walk away a little bit. Alright. Just do the old I'm gonna leave and then go back and absolutely attack it oh wow okay this is a whole lot deeper oh it made me lock off of them okay that made me off lock so oh back here Fast. Did you see how it like hugged the wall and then like scooted along it? That was crazy. Alright, how do I get these fishies? Totally like see me quite easily, quite quickly. Good, if I trap him into the wall that works. Take it. Oh, you got away. <laughs> oh, I got him. Wow. Perseverance, everybody. <laughs> Just don't give up on, on the fight. <laughs> wow. Okay. So that was a bunch more I got. Now, I'm at the front end of this where it first drops down i want to take this layer by layer like level by level i don't want to just drop down to the bottom and then go oh what and then like not know where i went so we're just gonna go around and if there's any caves or anything cool if there's any little nooks like this I'll, I'll swim onto it for now and see if i have or have not gone here yes i'm back here now now i know exactly where i'm at i don't need to go any further this is why I swim around, so I know where I'm going. Okay, now we go down another little layer. Uh, on top of the roofs. Is that a face? Okay, that looked like a face. <laughs> the spirally part was the eyes, the, the, the dark spots, the nose. The, there's like a crack making the face. Yeah, it was crazy. It looked like he was wearing a cool hat. I really thought that was a face underneath there. 
crazy. Ooh, a headless. I was uh, ill prepared for one of these, actually. I'm not healed or anything. Uh, that's bad, but I can probably take them. Uh, my divine confetti is going to take a really long time to kill it, though, aren't isn't it? Okay, uh, what is down here? Oh, is that the headless there? What is that thing, then? There's like a blue thing above it. Uh, either way, good to know. Oh, there's an item here. Look at that. Almost missed this. Okay, slow down. Precious bait. You mean to say if I were to throw the bait, it's a headless split in two, take the one, take out one, and kill them both. There's two headlesses, and I gotta, if I kill one, they both die. Oh, well, I haven't even seen what they look like yet, but all right, I guess there's two down there. EMI, too fast. Now you're telling me information that I would see, but before I see it. Malice, your info timing is terrible. <laughs> as friendly as I can say it, it's, it's terrible. Either you tell me something that I'm going to see, or you tell me something before I even see it, so you kind of... There's not two, he's split. There's not two, he's split. <laughs> But there's not two headlesses down there? Is that... That's what I'm saying? Ugh, this is gonna be harsh because I'm... I got, like, a few heals. And I would have to, like, go up graffiti and then... Come back down? But can I not get the one that's over there? Or you'll see. Ooh, there's treasure down there. Did they kill one of the large carps? Oh, well, I don't know. There's a blue one and a headless, so, like, I'm trying to figure out what this one's about. It's only got one health. Not ready for this. I can't eat any of this stuff because I'm underwater. I haven't even like fully explored yet. What is this blue one over here? Kill one, kill them both. He's split, there's not two. Let's see what, what, what you're talking about. He almost died. damage. What crazy powerful damage that was. Okay, heal up. Uh, terror be gone. That one over there is almost dead. So, if I could just keep attacking him with stuff. Can I kill a headless with kunai? I cannot. I can't off lock. I can't off lock. There we go. It's 
that was scary. Almost died again, walking in and just getting hit a little bit. The fight is, uh, this fight, the, I fight the other one mainly because he's uh, in a better spot to attack. But that guy's almost dead, do you see? Oh, I didn't mean to heal like that. I can't use pellets. Uh, I can't seem to use anything under... Yeah, I can't use anything under the water. Look like to me he's got his health back. He better not have got his health back. Oh, he did. Are you joking me? Why did he get his health back? Well, then there's no point to do this fight, then. There's zero point to do this fight. Uh, that was an absolute brutal miss. Okay, homeward idol. That's unfortunate. Um, that's super unfortunate. Um, because I almost had him kill. I just didn't think me swimming around would make him reset his health. Thanks for letting me see that, because it's almost done. Uh, make a divine graffiti and swim straight down. that house. I think I'm gonna be like out of divine con confetti before I even get down there, everybody. Like, completely. Uh, and you have to be out of the water to be able to do that. Uh, unfortunately, if you go too far away, he resets, so we've learned that the hard way, unfortunately. I think this is the only building that's close by other than that one over there. Those are just ribbons. Okay, if that was a monster, I'd been a little bit more worried. Um, bad malice you saw that, because that, uh, that would have got me in a lot of trouble. Um... I need divine confetti, and I also need to use up. Allow me to attack. Damage. Yes, I did notice. Square. So, do I kill him, or do I not kill him? That's what matters, I just almost killed the one that was almost transparent. That's so unfair. So unfair. Wow, that was a fast death, but it's fine. Are you sure killing the one in the middle is the right thing to do? I think killing the one in the back is the right one to kill, because I just got owned. The last time I was able to at least pull off a few attacks and then swim away. Um, the one in the middle leaves me attacked from that one. I think the one in the middle can't really get me over there. I'm going to try the other way, unless I have to take out the one in the middle first. I need to know... Well, I said I killed the physical one, so if I kill the transparent one, I, it might not work. Yeah, I would like to know. I, so I think uh, killing the one that looks like a ghost is the right one to kill over the one that looks solid, though. Just dropped a bunch of frames, didn't I? Uh, so I won't tell you what to do, but I killed the physical one and transparent one disappeared with it. Okay, so I'm going to assume that uh, if I kill the transparent one that's really easy to kill, it might get rid of it and then I could focus on the one. Uh, 
No, I I'm dropping frames all of a sudden. Uh, I'm dropping a lot of frames for no reason. Uh, and I'm just constantly dropping frames. So, this was supposed to be an early live stream, and I think I'm having uh, internet problems for whatever reason. Uh, I don't know if it's a server or... Oh, why did I just do that? thought it was me because you have bad weather here and the power flickered a few times. Oh. Uh, Batismo's still broken and Batismo hasn't been fixed yet. Well, apparently I landed underneath here. I'm having uh, internet problems, so I don't know what to say or do right now except, like, I, I don't want to stop. I was going to do a five-hour live stream, and I am now having internet problems. I hope it's not... Uh, uh, a telltale time of, of something. I'm trying to look my way up, but I don't think it's going to happen, everybody. I got to warp back up. Uh, so that's unfortunate because I was I would have gladly have done a five hour live stream tonight. I'm constantly buffering. Uh, OBS is literally saying you've dropped a bunch of frames and went red. So yeah, I'm just going to homeward. Homeward. I'm going from like 0 KBS to uh, to 10,000 again. I've had this problem before. I hope I could just like reset my modem or something. Uh, I'm not too sure. Heaven's OBS edition speak to me. It's just freaking out right now. It's, it's like either A, the server's gone, or B, my, my modem just decided to stop working. Uh, but I can't live stream this. Which is fine. I'm glad I caught it before I took on the headless down there. I'm going to, I mean, I think everybody can still hear me. It's just the connection to the live stream is what's messing up right now. So it's probably like being all choppy and glitchy and stuff. I, I don't know. Uh, I don't want to ruin this episode anymore. Uh, but uh, I, I can't live stream Sekiro when it's all beat up. So I might try to find like another small game to do tonight because I, I, I wanted to do a five hour live stream on this too. Ah, uh, why me? So I'll just try to find something else. I don't know what. There's no game I really want to play, but I'm not going to take the risk of playing in Sekiro again and it, my my something does not work tonight. Yeah, it's not choppy, but you can tell the frames are missing. Yeah, uh, and I'm dropping and gaining frames again. I have zero frames and 10,000. Like, that's not normal. I'm streaming at 6,000, so it should not go down below... Uh, 5,000 and above 6,000 and something. You know what I mean? So, like, it's allowed to be fluctuating, but it's not allowed to fluctuate to zero and then fluctuate to 10,000. That's not normal fluctuation. So I just have, like, a constant red bar, then yellow, then green, then it goes back to red again. Um, and I look over and I see 9,000, and then I see zero. So, like, uh, I'll just stop the live stream here. I'll try to find something to do. Uh, and I'll take on the two headless next. There's nothing else really for me to be fighting. Uh, but yeah, I'm thinking that Phantom 1 will drop down quicker. Uh, and, uh, I, Twitch was buffering all night tonight. Two or three times I had to refresh, refresh, uh, Twitch. So I'm thinking it might be even Twitch's end too. You never know. Either way, but I know my OBS is saying it's not making up the, the frames now. But uh, I'm just constantly dropping frames, so I, I can't I can't give you a, a, a bad show. Um, but yeah, I'll take out the spirit one first because he seemed to die really quickly. Uh, and I just need to like attack once or twice, get away, and then like get around and then get and then attack it again. Should be able to kill it in a few hits. And then if that disappears, the spirit one, perfect. Then I could go in the middle and try to kill the one in the middle without getting picked off by that sniper of a of a spirit. Um, the terror hits me and I die. Like not not the field terror. The terror hits the little the little light 
beam things that hit me and takes out all my health. That's incredibly powerful, but uh, still doable. I just gotta not have two of them attacking me with ranged attacks. Um, again, I can, I, I can defeat them on land, there's no problem. I just can't do what I do on land in, under the water, so just gotta play very defensively and waiting too long is just gonna keep getting me hit. I forgot all about the the, uh, the grab the grab thing that they do. Uh, that's gonna be a little tricky to get used to, but should be all right as long as I don't get picked off too much with the terror that I can't see because I'm locked on the other enemy. Uh, and not locking on and swimming means that you're just gonna be going wherever you're aiming, or maybe not even if you just hit circle, you just might be going upward. But yeah, can I like refresh my my live stream or not? I don't think I can. I don't think I can like refresh my uh, uh, I don't think I can like refresh my stream so that it gets good uh, either. Well, 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 I was not planning this. My, 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 my plans were dashed. But uh, it's fine. It's sometimes these things happen. Um, I'll just, uh, I'll just see if I could find another game. If not, I mean a two hour live stream is long enough. It does count as a live stream, but I feel like I just want to keep playing something anyway. In fact, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I, I gotta go check to see if I can go live again. But I, I might even be Sekiro again. But I won't be. Uh, I won't be uh, <laughs> playing story. I'll just run around and make some money or something, or just try to get some skills or something. Just have like a, 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 a just talking live stream where I'm playing Sekiro and chatting, and not really focusing on Sekiro. But yeah, I'm constantly like losing Twitch live stream. It's probably cut the episode in half numerous times. I'm not sure, but uh, I'll, I'll end this here in case if it is all chopped up in halves and stuff, and I'll just I'll try to fix it for the editing. Expect me to be not live right away, but I'll see what I can do. Let's see if I can get things working again. So yeah, Malice, you were pretty much here the whole time. Thank you so much for that. And a few other people who stopped by and then went to bed. But uh, yeah, uh, my bad for a short Sekiro episode. I'm just having live stream issues, which then messes up the episode issue. So yeah, I'll just I'll play it smart. Uh, so thanks, Heavenlies, for showing up and watching. And seriously, if you like what I'm doing. Please hit those buttons. You know what to do by now. And I will see you all in the next episode. Take care.